On Saturday, the 20th of May, as part of the Flying Scotsman centenary celebrations, the Keithley and Worth Valley Railway hosted an evening with Flying Scotsman at Oxenhope, the terminus of the line. Guests were greeted with a glass of champagne and live music on the platform before the arrival of the star attraction for the evening. Also at the railway for the event was former owner Pete Waterman OBE, who was more than happy to pose for photographs, sign prints of the locomotive, and even share a story or two about his music career. Everywhere Flying Scotsman goes, the public just can't get enough of her, and as such was admired by photographers and those wanting a selfie with the celebrity. Following some time on the platform, getting up close and personal with the engine, the whistle blew to indicate that it was time for the evening's banquet to commence. <coughs> Guests made their way into the exhibition shed, which had been converted into a dining hall to enjoy a three-course meal followed by a presentation on the Flying Scotsman, with guest speeches by former owner Pete Waterman and director Colin Green of Riley & Sons, who maintain the engine to keep her running on the national network. Introducing Key Model World, your new online destination for everything railway and scale modelling. Featuring exclusive videos and features, unseen images, step-by-step -step guides, railway history and the latest news. Plus, it's home to our full layout build series. I'm going to stop you right there though, because okay. I didn't do this. This is all you're doing. Join us for the latest content from Key Publishing's modelling titles, Hornby Magazine and Airfix Model World. Sign up today for as little as £3.75 per month, or if you're a magazine subscriber, bolt Key Model World onto your subscription package now. For more details, visit keymodelworld.com.